how to use the round down function in Microsoft Excel. Hello everyone, welcome to Excel 10 tutorial. In this function explain video series, I'm going to explain how to use the round down function in Microsoft Excel. I'm going to talk about the parameters and I'm going to show you why it's different from the integer and the truncate function. Let's get started. <laughs> The best way to learn a function is to apply it and in this tutorial I'm going to apply the round down function here and while I am applying it here I will explain the parameters and I will explain why it's different than integer and truncate function. So I'm going to write here equal to and then round down and here we have our round down function okay and the tooltip says rounds the number down towards zero. Now here this towards zero, this part is really important. So if you are rounding down negative number, it will also move towards zero, okay? So I'm going to double click here and the first parameter is the number, the number you want to round down. I'm going to select the cell where I have number and here the second parameter, it's also a mandatory parameter and we need to specify the digit. So if I want two decimal, we'll have to write two. Okay, but here we have maximum two decimals, so I don't want any digit after the decimal point. So I'm going to write here zero. Now here is one of the big difference with the integer and the round down and the truncate function. Round down function has two parameter and the second parameter number of digit. It's a mandatory parameter. You have to specify it. Even if you don't want any decimal point, you'll have to specify it with zero. Where integer function doesn't have the second parameter and the truncate function have the second parameter, but it's it's not mandatory, it's optional. Without the parameter, the function works. But here in round down function, it doesn't work without this parameter, okay? So I don't want any digit after the decimal point, so I have specified it with zero. And I'm going to close parentheses, and if I press enter, 12 equal to 12, 12.23 12 becomes 12, okay? And now here, this is the important part. Here, we have 12.99, but we are rounding down. That's why it's not going to be 13, it's become 12, and it's moving towards the zero. All the positive numbers will round down in this way, and it will move towards to zero, okay? And all the negative points, that will also go above and move towards to zero. So here, 12.99, it should be minus 13 but here we are rounding down and round down function round it towards the zero so negative 1299 become minus 12 okay so this is how the round down function works and this is what i wanted to show you thank you thanks for watching see you in the next tutorial if you can support the channel through patreon and don't forget to subscribe thank you thanks for watching